Hello viewers, welcome to the Healthy Lifestyle channel. Today we are going to be discussing the developmental stages of twin babies. Fertilization, week zero. Before we continue, don't forget to subscribe, like, share and comment. Please hit the notification bell icon. Fraternal twins or dizygotic twins occur when two separate eggs are released during ovulation and are fertilized by two separate sperm cells. These twins have different genetic material, just like any siblings born at different times. Identical twins or monozygotic twins happen when a single egg is fertilized by one sperm, but later splits into two embryos. They share identical DNA. Early cell division, week one. The fertilized egg or eggs begin dividing as they travel through the fallopian tube toward the uterus. By the end of the first week, the embryo or embryos become blastocysts and start implanting in the uterine lining. Implantation and early development, weeks two to three, the embryos embed in the uterine lining. The placenta and umbilical cord begin forming. In identical twins, depending on when the embryo splits, they may share a placenta known as monochorionic or have separate ones known as dichorionic. From week four to eight, a fascinating process unfolds. Neural tubes, which will become the brain and spinal cord, start to form. Around week five to six, the heart begins to beat. By week eight, basic organs and facial features are starting to develop. During this time, twins are measured via ultrasound and doctors check if they share a placenta or sac, which is crucial for managing any potential risks. From week nine to twelve, the embryos are now officially called fetuses. Arms, legs, fingers and toes begin to form. Kidneys, liver and other organs start to function. By the end of week 12, external genitalia start to develop, though they might not always be visible on ultrasound just yet. The second trimester spans from week 13 to week 26. During weeks 14 to 18, babies start moving and kicks may be felt around 18 to 20 weeks. Their skin is thin and covered with lanugo, which is fine hair. Ears, eyes and fingerprints also form during this period. By week 20, which is the midpoint, an anatomy scan often confirms twins and checks for their growth, organs and any abnormalities. It's not uncommon for twins to show size differences due to sharing the placenta in monozygotic cases. From weeks 21 to 26, there is rapid brain growth. The lungs begin producing surfactant, which is important for breathing after birth. Babies may also start to respond to sounds and light. Moving into the third trimester, which lasts from week 27 to week 40, babies grow rapidly in size and weight from weeks 27 to 32. Their eyes can open and close and they practice breathing movements. Between weeks 33 and 36, most twins are born. During this time, they continue gaining fat and maturing their organs. The chances of survival without complications are high. After week 34, by weeks 37 to 38, twins are considered full term. Most doctors recommend delivery by this time to prevent complications like growth restriction or placental issues. At birth, fraternal twins have separate placentas and sacs. Identical twins may share a placenta or sac, depending on when the embryo split. Delivery may be vaginal or by C-section, depending on positioning, health and any complications. Twin pregnancies are high risk, so extra monitoring is standard. Kindly subscribe, like, share and comment. Thanks for watching.